Greetings. Here are my reflections on the 2022 ESRI User Conference and the Education Summit. First of all, you might wonder, why are all these people getting together to talk about just technology? It's not just technology. For as long as people have been thinking about and trying to understand the world, maps have been used to gain understanding, wisdom, and to make smarter decisions. That is exactly the purpose of the ESRI User Conference and the Education Summit. SGIS rules, it is absolutely critical to building a more equitable, sustainable, resilient world. I firmly believe that. I've been attending the user conference since I was at the U.S. Geological Survey way back in 1998, and here are my reflections. First of all, mapping common ground, as you can see from some of these images, was the theme for this year. The idea was creating agreed-upon understanding, and from that understanding, we can then move forward. Number two, the geographic approach is starting to be adopted by organizations, nonprofit, government agencies, academia, private industry, to build a smarter, happier, more sustainable world. It's basically considering all the factors, the biosphere, the lithosphere, the atmosphere, the cryosphere, the anthroposphere, all the factors in making the smartest decisions possible. Third, GIS is advancing, as we saw in this conference. and. In our technical workshops, Expo Hall, as you can see here, meetings, collaborative efforts, cloud, real-time, 3D, design, analytics, communication, all those are advancing and moving forward. Number four, GIS professionals have important responsibilities. People put their trust in GIS professionals, and GIS professionals have a key role in building this more sustainable world. And finally, GIS, on a related note, is being recognized as mission critical, in other words, critical in an, any organization's mission to make as smart and as wise a decision as possible in, in their daily work. I salute the students, secondary, community technical tribal college, university, lifelong learners, the GIS professionals in government, academia, private industry, nonprofits and the people that are not GIS professionals but are interested in employing and using geospatial technology and the spatial thinking method in their daily work. I salute work. Esri, Jack Dangerman and others for making these tools possible but first and foremost to the user community for your vision, your energy, your expertise. Map on!